This is a tutorial on finding copyright-free images to use in your essays. If you're writing an essay on fish farming, your paper can be improved by using appropriate images. There are millions of images in the internet, but most of them are owned by someone, and it is illegal to use them without negotiation and sometimes paying a fee. But there are also millions of images you can use for free. All you have to do is give credit to the photographer and you can add the image to your essay. There are two great sources that we will look at, Flickr and Wikipedia. Flickr has a very simple search box. Let's search fish farms. We get thousands of results, but which ones are free for you to use? For that, what we need to do is go to Advanced Search and then Page Down. Click in the box beside Only Search Within Creative Commons Licensed Content and search again. To see how we can use these photos, click on the second picture. This shows the photographer. To see more details, we click on All Sizes. This page gives you many size options for download and then shows you the Creative Commons license terms. To see what the symbols mean, click on Some Rights Reserved. Nearly all Creative Commons pictures have an attribution license. All that means is you have to give credit to the photographer. The simplest method is to include the URL of the photograph as a source, just like you would cite a book. Now that you're sure of your right to use a photo, you can download the best size for your essay. Let's look at the second source, Wikipedia Commons. This is part of Wikipedia, but it has its own page at the bottom of the screen. Use the search box for fish farm. When we open an image, it shows the licenses. In this case, there are two licenses. Both are open source, which is another term for copyright free. This search used the normal Wikipedia search box, but Wikipedia also has a specialized search called Mayflower. We can search the same term as before, and this search result suggests using the term fish farming. We can select an image and download it. These internet tools offer ease and convenience, but finding just the right image can still be hard. If you want more control in searching for images, talk to your librarian. Librarians know how to search databases like Academic Search and GroveArt. Some of those databases are developing image searches, but that will be another tutorial. This concludes this tutorial.